Hi there, it's Claire from Clarify Creations and today's video is going to be a full day of nursing school. A day in the life of a nursing student and it starts really really early. I woke up at 7 this morning and it's currently 7.50 so that means it's time to hop on to my first class. I've got three classes today, they're really packing in on Mondays. So the first one is pharmacology and that starts at 8 and it's a Zoom class. Just made it to Med Surge and I got here just a few minutes before because class went out late and I had to run to get here but I made it so we're gonna have class now. Every two hour class needs snacks so today we have some white cheddar goldfish or no those are white cheddar. Sarah's eating the white cheddar poppables. These are the original goldfish, and then my mom made some pecan bars, which are really, really good. I don't know if this is gonna be enough food, though. So guys, we just got out of Psych Mental Health, and it was very interesting. We had a voices simulation, and that was basically where you listen to a bunch of voices in your earbuds for an hour and a half. Yeah, that's exactly what it sounded like, and it was- Tomato, tomato. Keep going. It was pretty Turtle. crazy. Turtle. It was long and I'm tired, but Sarah got us a cookie <laughs> the size of my head. <laughs> Leave it up to Sarah. We were ordering a chicken Cadillac from the Rising Room, and then all of a sudden she grabs this cookie and she's like, here, buy this. <laughs> so we bought a giant cookie and this chocolate chip. Yep. Yep. When you've been listening to voices for like an hour or two hours, you want a giant cookie too, okay? I think it's been like two and a half hours. It was a really long time of just... Turtles! Chocolate Turtles. chip muffin. Donut! Donut! Yeah. You are the way. The way! You are the way. Yeah. It was super weird, and some of the things the voices were saying were not very nice. So if you guys are nursing students and go to UT and have the class Psych Mental Health, that's us. Oh. Okay. Yeah. We should. Yeah. Bye. <laughs> that is what we're doing. Now we're just getting dinner, obviously. We've got the sandwich and the cookie. I also brought some chips from home. And then we're going to go to an SNA meeting from 5 to 6. And then my Precious Prince meeting, which is a little bit after that. Chicken Cadillac has chicken, bacon, lettuce, and cheese. You can never have too many napkins. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Sarah knows me. I always need a bunch of napkins, guys. Okay guys, I am heading back home and it is currently 7-11. So it's definitely been a full day. I'm just heading out to my car where I parked to eventually get on the road, get going. And my mom made dessert, so I'm very excited about that. She made a baked good. I love my mom's food and cooking. And I'm officially at my car. And here is what I walked home to. I've been told that this is coffee with powdered sugar. Mm. That's really good. Since this vlog is still pretty short, I thought I'd share with you guys what I do for my night routine on Mondays. This can always be changing. With nursing school, schedules are always changing, so some Mondays I have more things to do and more classes and more events, and then other Mondays I don't have as many, but this one was definitely a really, really long one. So I am back at my trusty desk, and I'm just going to be checking my email, making sure that I'm caught up in everything. That's something Something I like to do as soon as I get home because you never know who's going to email you in between that time from 4 o'clock until 
think it is 8.30, so it's kind of late now. And a lot of people like to send emails right before the day is over, and then if you don't check them, you should just check them. Okay, I have one email and it's just the ball update, so it's nothing pressing or anything. Another thing I like to do is to cross off anything I did in my planner. This thing is a lifesaver in nursing school, and at the beginning of the day, I used to do this by week, and sometimes I still will, but this day I planned it out last night and just went through everything I need to do. So the fun part is to actually check some things off, so I'm gonna do that. So I did pretty much everything that I had to get done, but I do need to study some because I have a pharmacology exam coming up on Wednesday, and it's Monday at 8.44, and have I really studied for this exam? Not really. And am I a little bit stressed about it at this point, considering I'm probably not going to study much tonight? Yes, yes I am. You have a lot of stress and sometimes you don't get to studying until the last minute and guys, that is okay. I'm not saying that you should always be studying the day before or anything, but if you know that you can handle it and you know you can get the information done, then it'll be all right. And I do know, I've done this before, <laughs> managed to do well in the past, so I'm just gonna put my mind to it tomorrow. I'm gonna try and get as much done tonight as possible, and then we will go from here. We just came back from spring break, and I really could have spent a lot of my spring break studying, but I was just so fatigued, and I really needed that time to not be focused on pharmacology and all these things as school and everything. And that was the trade-off I made, and I am not upset about it or anything. I did it to myself, but now it is time to get to work. I'm pretty proud of myself for making it this far because it's past 9 o'clock, and normally I get into my pajamas as soon as I get back home, which I don't know is a healthy habit or not. So I'm going to end the vlog here because I still have so much work to do. So anyways, if you guys have any questions about nursing school or if you have any comments at all, I'd love to talk with you, and I will see you guys later. Bye!